shoplifting. You shoplifting? You can't shoplift here. Excuses? Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? That's bad. Bad shoplifting excuses. I don't even remember. Uh, my hose got stuck. That doesn't even make sense. I want to tell you my secret now. That's right, shoplifters. I catch them by blending in with my surroundings. Yeah, I got a shoplifter. Why? Because I'm paid to by an evil corporation. It's not personal, son. It's strictly business. And as far as jobs go, it's pretty fun. Blah, blah, blah. It's so super fun. Because shoplifters do all kinds of crazy stuff. All right, come on, man. It's time to go. <laughs> Yes, that really happened. But the stupidest thing shoplifters do is making ridiculous excuses for their behavior. Dude, why the heck did you steal this girly penguin sweater? Because I want it. Give me it. Give me it. Come on, give me it. I'm sorry. Please. Please. No, I'm not going to give it to you. Ugh, come on. I'm going to tell you the stories of the stupid excuses I get all the time, starting with my personal favorite. What are you doing? Nothing. Are you taking groceries? It's out of my cart. Uh, my hose got stuck. That doesn't even make sense. Oh! 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 oh. What are you doing? That's right. We're talking about fake medical emergencies. Call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! But not for me! Heart attacks. Don't you hate it when you're just enjoying a meal with your friends and then your heart attacks you out of nowhere? <laughs> Can you imagine the feeling of betrayal? Head to Hardis. Yeah. The craziest thing about heart attacks is that they could happen at literally any moment. <laughs> oh. Even young people can have heart attacks. His palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy. 24 and I'm having a heart attack already? <sighs> Anyways, the single weirdest thing about heart attacks though is the sheer number of shoplifters who have a heart attack right at the moment that it catch them stealing. It's almost as if... Is it possible? That there are no coincidences. It's not a coincidence at all. It's not a coincidence at all. Meet Maria. Maria really likes gardening. I know this because I observed her load up $60 worth of gardening equipment into her cart and then walk out the door without paying for it. But that's stealing! Exactly. But when I approached her at the door, she did something that I did not expect at all. Did she just have a heart attack? Yep. I, of course, immediately called 911. Hello, uh, thank you for calling Domino's. How can I help you? Uh, wrong number. My bad. Actually, while I have you, can I, can I get a large pepperoni? Yeah, it's gonna need to be delivered, because I'm kind of in the middle of something. Oh, ac actually, let me just let you go. Sorry. She was able to move into my office, but she was coughing and yelling the entire time. <laughs> oh, my heart! Uh, my chest! Uh, 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 uh. I was just as surprised as you are about her voice. What? What the frick? I was expecting her to have your, you know, typical grandma voice. I've fallen and I can't get up! But instead, it sounded like a dude who's been smoking for 20 years. Yeah, what are you looking at? Take a picture, it'll last longer. Anyways, Maria just <laughs> kept coughing and hacking the whole time. Meanwhile, I was actually pretty concerned. This is the worst! I had never killed anybody before, and I didn't want to start today. But I could tell by the sheriff's face, <laughs> he thought she was faking it. <laughs> but why would somebody fake a heart attack? Uh, sweet, innocent, younger Josh. There's so much I wish I could teach you. Look at his little baby face. Look, look, look at his cheeks. Look at his little cheeks. Uh, anyways, but I can teach you guys. You see, when I catch a shoplifter, they're supposed to go directly to jail. You are stealing right to jail, right away. No trial, no, no nothing. This is why a lifter will occasionally fake a medical emergency. Oh, I think it might be broken. You assaulted me, and I'm injured. My face, is my face still there? Apparently they seem to think that if they have a medical emergency, we won't prosecute them. Come closer. Get out of jail free card. 
But it's not like faulty logic ever stopped a shoplifter before. I'm gonna sue you! Shut up! Come on, man! Jeez. Anyways, back to your regularly scheduled congestive heart failure. Maria just kept coughing and hacking. She even threw up on the floor. <laughs> Luckily, I didn't have to clean that up, but I feel really bad for the person who did. Six and a half hours later. <sighs> I'm just a cleaning lady! Ah, oh, dead body! Six and a half hours earlier. While Maria was cleaning the puke off her face, I heard a noise outside. Reinforcements had arrived. It was the fire department. A fireman burst through the door. He went straight to Maria and started measuring her vitals. Ma'am, you are completely fine. There is nothing wrong with you at all. Her heart attack intensified. Oh! Oh my chest! Oh! Oh! Then the fireman said something that literally healed her. Well then, we will have to call an ambulance. Her heart attack immediately stopped, and she said, Ambulance? I can't afford no ambulance. Can't someone just drive me home? The fireman just rolled his eyes and left. But the sheriff? He laughed. He looked at everyone in the room and said, Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. The sheriff did end up giving her a ride, though. Straight to jail. A few months later, Maria pled guilty, and I never heard from her again. And thus ends the story of Maria. But this is not the end for fake medical emergencies. Call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! But not for me! People still fake things all the time, and it's not just heart attacks. Okay, all right, John. It's time to go up to the city jail so I can sign a warrant on you. Oh my gosh, you're faking an aneurysm. Come on, dude, I don't have time for this. Let's go. John? John? Chapter 2. Wait. Oh, this video is getting way too long. I'm gonna have to make this a two-part video. Let me know in the comments if you're interested in seeing more of me grabbing my own breasts. <sighs> Here's a sneak peek of the next episode. Click right here to watch the video about the best shoplifter I ever encountered. Okay, bye.